Hello, this is Claudia with Olivos Art Studio bringing you your weekly pick a card. I am at the seaside in a beautiful place filled with eucalyptus trees. I just found these seashells, including that beautiful sea urchin at the beach and this huge feather. So we're working with a lot of, oh, and this pine cone, working with a lot of energy from the earth, the ocean, and of course, sacred mothers and goddesses. So go ahead and pick the card that is speaking to you, or the item, the pile, the seashell pile, goddess, or eucalyptus seed cone. And we will look at these cards again. Take notes and see what the images say to you. First one for this pile is Mama Kocha with a seashell. Love it when that happens. So Mama Kocha, dive deep. Shadow work. What are you working on within yourself this week? We also have Green Tara <clears throat> with compassion and empathy. So perhaps whatever it is you're working with, you need to think about how and where you add compassion and empathy. And we have Bastet, the guardian and protectress, with a message of security, sensuality, and she's also the goddess of love's perfumes. So these are the three cards for the first pile, if you chose the seashell, if you chose the sacred mother goddess. Your pile is... Ooh, Mary Magdalene, courage, visionary, Kuan Yin, forgiveness, and Rhiannon for self-love. Mm. I'm really liking how these spreads of three are working together. Let's see what the eucalyptus pine cone has in store for us for you ooh embrace the sacred feminine and Gaia for evolution I can attest to that embracing the sacred feminine does bring incredible evolution of our heart and soul, spiritual evolution, emotional evolution. Oh, priestess of divination definitely leads to much more of an open connection. Love these spreads. Love these three. Very nice. So let me go ahead and pull a chakra goddess, from the mini chakra goddesses, one for each pile. That will mean it is perhaps uh, your chakra that's blocked and that will, or that you need to pay attention to for whatever issue has come up for you when you think about these. And today I'm not going to put the chakras, mini goddesses, back after I pull them. I'm going to pull one for each one. So first one, ooh, we have... The root chakra. This one just fell out. I'm not sure whether it was out already, but <clears throat> this is the third eye. So let's just use both for this one. So for this one, third eye and root chakra. So intuition and definitely grounding for this pile. I am going to have to put them back because many of them came out. Okay, let's see, for the second pile, we have the sacral. Sacral chakra, a lot to do with your emotions, with your will, with your independence as well, which then has a lot to do with empowerment. And... 
And here we have again third eye intuition for the third pile priestess of divination. So that's it for your pick a card for today. I hope that it blessed you. Leave me a message. Let me know if these are bringing you messages. I hope so. I hope they um, are an, a beautiful tool for you to use on your path. All right. I love you and I wish you a beautiful, beautiful day from the bottom of these beautiful pine trees and eucalyptus trees here in Chile. <laughs>